My name is Charles. When I was seven, I had my kidney transplant. My name's Ollie, and I was diagnosed with an eye condition called keratoconus at the age of 17, and I had a cornea transplant at the age of 19. got diagnosed with diabetes a month before my 13th birthday and then ever since then my life's been pretty much back and forth to hospital. I'm Dawn, I'm Harry James's mum. Harry um, had just passed away, um, the hospital had called time and then Myself and his dad were left for a couple of minutes and although we'd never discussed organ donation, if it was a conversation that we'd have had whilst he was still here, um, I do believe that he would have wanted to. As I got older, my kidneys were getting weaker and weaker and so I was put on dialysis for four years whilst I was waiting for a transplant. It was really hard for me because due to ethnic background, it took them a while to find me a kidney. A life on dialysis isn't fun. I've got to be grateful for it because it is making me feel better. You never think it's going to be you in this position, sitting, waiting for organs on the list. So the symptoms I was getting before I was diagnosed was um, distortion in my uh, vision, uh, various halos around the eye. I was very lucky that I was able to get my kidney because I don't think there was any other way of me actually getting a kidney. I was very ill and obviously if I hadn't found a kidney donor, my health would have gone sort of worse and worse. And I'm hoping this transplant will mean that I can get back out there, work, travel, just do what normal 30-year-olds do. So I've got to just focus on everything I want to do after. Um, when I finally got the letter saying, uh, giving me the date for my surgery, I was, I was as ecstatic. So I think Harry would be happy that he has helped those other people and that those other people can continue now and, and have more years with their families even continue to have other families of their own. The moment I opened my eye, I almost fell over. Because <laughs> uh, uh, obviously um, I wasn't so used to seeing clear vision. Even though I had to wait four years, I think that four years was worth it. Anyone who's interested in the organ donor campaign, they should get straight to it. I'd ask everyone to join the organ donation register and make sure you have the conversation with your family and friends. It's not an easy one to have, but these donors and their families, if they, they, they're giving people like me a second chance to live and, and conquer the world that at the moment, just not, we're not able to do. Since Harry's passed away, the opportunity has arose to speak to people about being on the organ donation list. And every time I'd, I'd say, go ahead and do it. Sadly, Harry couldn't continue with his life, but he's helped at least three other people to continue with their life.